I'm Adam Anschell for Pro Football Weekly, along with our draft expert, Nolan Naraki, with a Carolina Panthers draft confidential presented by Verizon Fios. And Nolan, there's been a lot of rumors swirling around the Panthers about whether they'll take Cam Newton first overall. Is there any chance of that? Well, Adam, I think GM Marty Herney would like everyone to believe that he's going to take him. If you really boil out down the character and the background, I think owner Jerry Richardson is going to shy away from that pick. I think there's just too much there. You know, they tend to draft very conservatively, and I think they're going to look in another direction. So if he's not in the mix at one, I know Ron Rivera had said at the Combine that there were seven to ten prospects that they were going to try and sort out. Who's left? Well, Alabama defensive tackle Marcel Darius is the guy that fills the biggest need inside there at defensive tackle. But you also got uh, Patrick Peterson from LSU, the cornerback, who also doubles as a return man. And A.J. Green from Georgia, the receiver, who, who if you eliminate the quarterback out of the equation, I think he fills the biggest need offensively. So then, if, if, if given all of that, what would be the perfect scenario for the Panthers? Well, I think they'd like to move back to that third spot where, you know, Buffalo's looking at a quarterback. I'd like to think they want Buffalo to come up and be able to pick up that second round pick that they're missing from a year ago that they dealt in New England. So if they can come away with a second round pick and uh, a receiver like A.J. Green, I think they'd be very happy. So what do you think will end up happening? Well, if they're forced to stand put, I think they, they will go with A.J. Green. I mean, he's the guy that makes the most sense. I think he's the safest of those three players. and. You know, he's a guy that's going to be able to come in right away and make an immediate impact. It would be interesting, too, because it would be the first wide receiver taken back since Keyshawn Johnson went first overall to the Jets. We appreciate it, Nolan. For all the best draft information, be sure to follow us on Twitter or pick up the PFW Draft Preview Book at ProFootballWeekly.com.